Hello and welcome back. So today's video, I am going to make a trial and error video. So it's not a tutorial, it's just me documenting my journey. This is a war game. Basically it's overthewire.org. I wanted to try it uh, and I wanted to try it on camera. So let's get started. Let me see where the putty is. So here are the instructions. Okay. So we get a connection. So let's connect. I did not read the full instruction on the last page only because I have just a itty bitty experience with uh, this thing. You can accept it. Again, let's do it over here on the side. Log in as the. Oh. So in buddy to paste anything it's right click pass oh hopefully it's in there it is and I'm in nope okay maybe it did not like me entering the again still exit Good. that's it Yeah. Oh, here is the reason. See, the reason is copy is the port number. Now I'm going to get the accept box again. So in PuTTY, if you have connected and accepted once, it will remember like your computer system will remember to store that certificate and this prompt will not pop up. So each time this prompt comes up, you know you're connecting to a new host. That's when you have to pay just a little bit more. Um, All right, go to the level one page. <clears throat> Read me located in the home directing. Okay, so we're gonna list read me, cat read me. That is the password. We're gonna, oh, oh, nice. Double click, copied it, right click, pasted it. Nice. So, oh, actually they give you the file as well. Uh, the commands that you may need to solve this level. That's pretty cool. Wow, nice. All right, bandit one using SSH. All right, now we're gonna again fire up another putty. We're gonna use the one what is level one to do hmm let's see it's this one Let's pose and two zero. We open it, see if we get the prompt. We get this bandit one. The password we have it from here. We do it right click twice. It's gonna error out. I'm logged in. Alright. Let's do. 
scroll dash ls I have the file name here cat I can't now for dashed file name Google search for dash so cat did not work let's see do you do dash nope so since I did not get the command uh, next prompt control C to close it and I'm out uh, let's try the dash file dash file I'm using terminal stack okay <laughs> read this command yes okay I think I'm gonna try both of them actually cat less than dot I have the password I learned something new and then it says cat dosh I have the password cool all right that's nice uh, let's go here oh I search on the same thing that's bad shouldn't have done that I got my next password double click to copy it and we go to level two <clears throat> spaces in the file located in the home directory again actually let me see if I can do quickly one thing where is putty and session logging session I'm gonna oh, control a I can I have the drop down list nope all right so in this case let's see this zero and we save it saved session uh, save session name over the wire dash bandit let's save it open where are you huh oh shoot that's how you make mistakes load save <laughs> silly mistakes <clears throat> all right so now this time is it still bandit or bandit 3 like what's going on here login as bandit two or three oh I was in two right test file name level one to do now I'm going to three so bandit two probably and for the password let's go here double click single click enter I'm in ls Spaces in this file name. Uh, so we're gonna go to level three. Okay, that is new. Maybe that is the file. Cat tab and I have the password so basically what I did is I pressed enter or not another enter the tab so what tab does is it completes uh, the file or the command for you on command prompt so I have the password so spaces in the file name space in Okay, I want to try this. So 
so what happened was when I press tab it did this by default but what I want to do is I want to try this with the single quote so cat the file name is uh, single quote spaces in this file name and I have the password cool again I did that okay so let's go I have the password let's go to level 4 and I'm gonna run another putty click load open this time bandit 3 double click here single right click here enter <sighs> what oh the login is incorrect yes buddy load bandit three enter and I'm in <clears throat> in here so I like this I, I, I I'm enjoying it with this game so this time again LS I have the in here file cat in here does anything is a directory so I have to CD in here I am an in here LS there is nothing okay LS in here I don't see any file What does du does du eight eight tab nothing happened find hidden so that there is a dot how to find the hidden Okay, head. No, I'm not looking at the first time. Come on, how to <clears throat> okay? Alice, hey, I have a hidden file cat dot hidden. I have the password. <clears throat> all right so the easiest way let's read a little bit more just itty bitty more i said alternately use the capital a what does the capital a does so do you okay so capital a basically got rid of these dots right there in order to exclude the implied folders okay so basically to switch between the commands that have you, you have already used is the up arrow key this video is getting long making me nervous but now how many levels I got zero to four let's go to level five right so not executable 
Okay. Let's go to party. Load. Bandit four. The password is nope. I'm in ls cd in here ls ls dash a no I need to see the Go actually here so you can see everything um, where, where did I put man okay all okay almost all author escape block size okay that is B or what dot f let uh, a press h for q to quit manual page q so ls dash f uh, nope ls dash dash file size Again, again, size okay, ls dash s. So, nope, it's not giving me so for time, time, style, style, you. Slash H. What? It's giving me everything. See? They're all human readable. I want to find the size. Contacts, width, tab size, contacts. that ls line b block size uh, what what does it say b block size equal to size Hmm. Come on. <clears throat> Kibi bytes dash K LS dash one dash K. What the hell?
this is ordered by sign. LA. There you go. 4096, 4096. And what about capital S? Same data. Okay, 33, okay, that's the bytes, is that what it's saying? I guess then all of the files have the prep password so let's go cat um, file zero zero cat dash file zero zero cat what was it less than reset I lost everything. Ls cat dot dash file zero two reset. Okay, zero three zero four. I nope. I did not I don't have the password. Cat zero five L S A zero six seven I have the password, I believe. But this is not the where it's failing is that uh, it did not give me the extensions human readable so I had to do that all and over here you can see it's still giving me everything and all of them are 33 bytes but it should have given me uh, the extensions how to list extensions right there dot L ls dot lsr we did lsr find okay we're gonna go with find then let's go okay find yeah cool it's at least uh, much better find help test normal actions OK, 
Okay. Data. All right, so, so much with LS. We're gonna learn fine before we end this file. Oh man. Should I press Q? Didn't have any, okay. Hmm. Find. No, I want to find. I'm going to pause the video here. All right, so after digging through this page, I really like this Stack Exchange uh, for Linux. Um, this command right here did what I was looking for. Uh, if you look other things, like these are crazy. Uh, this one is really crazy. Like you have to go read which, what each is, how why you're using pipe and all that. So there should be, for this level, like the level zero, there should be a simple command, not this much advanced. So what I found is the best one right here. I did it right here, you can see. And it gives me all the files. Now these are data files, data can be anything, but file 07 is the ASCII text that we were able to read. Now if we try to read that file, that is cat file 07. Oh, cat less than dash file zero seven, and I have the password. So this is it for this video. I'm gonna wrap it up here. It's otherwise it's gonna be way too long. I hope this video has helped you. If it has, please rate, comment, subscribe, and share. And I see you in the next one.